Good evening, everybody, and welcome to another nightly dump. <laughs> now, the reason I'm not doing my usual sort of down the outside, filtering headlong into traffic is because I'm recovering from cold and my head's a bit spinny, shall we say. So I'm taking it very easy with the filtering tonight. Ah, lovely stuff, eh? As it's a nighttime vlog, let's talk about nightmares. Now, anybody who's been following me for a while, now I think got a thing about spiders. I don't like them. <laughs> Not that I just don't like them. I I really don't like them. And uh, I had this dream last night, it's just bizarre. I don't know what triggered it. You can usually trace your dreams back to something you've watched on TV or something. And all I watched last night was like Family Guy and American Dad. You know, the usual quality entertainment. But I had this dream that I was being chased around the house by this big spider. I can't remember it all, but I remember bits of it. Like most dreams we have, we remember bits. Now, the bits I remember was being chased around the house by this huge spider. Now this spider, when I say huge, it was huge. It's about as big as a car. Uh, tire or wheel and so it had a massive body a massive head and great big what they call those things those like teeth they have massive those <laughs> of course I'm shitting myself because <laughs> I don't like spiders so I'm worried all the way through this thing that I'm being chased by this bloody thing no, I'm ch it's chased me all around the house I'm sweating like mad in bed obviously <laughs> and um it's the next thing I remember about it, you know, obviously being petrified and everything, is I'm trying to flush it down the toilet. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand either, you know. I, I really don't get it. So there, there I am, like, trying to flush this great big mammoth spider down the toilet. And... It's not going very well, you know, <laughs> it doesn't want to go down. So its legs are like kind of flashing everywhere. Water's going everywhere. And, um, and um, eventually I'm flashing its own mind. I think I'm bashing it with a broom or something and my wife's there stamping on it. And uh, eventually, it starts losing its legs. Well, I don't, don't know why I said eventually, but it starts losing its legs. And so it's, it starts losing its legs, you know, the legs start dropping off and everything. And I'm still trying to flush it down to an hour. Flushing and flushing and flushing. And it's still not going, you know, it's refusing to go. It's only got two left, two legs left at this time and most of its furry bits have, have disappeared too. You know, so it's got two legs left. And all its fur is like coming off and it's bleeding and it's, it's really quite vile at this stage. And at this point I've just lost the plot, I'm like, you know, I don't like this. <laughs> I've run off out of the bathroom. And next thing I know I'm in the kitchen and this, this spider's like followed me in there and it's got these two legs, it's a sorry sight and it's like, not saying anything, but it's just like pleading with me to like, you've done this to me, you finished me off, you bastard! <laughs> and the next thing I know, I've got a great big shovel from somewhere, a spade, and I'm, I'm like hacking it. <laughs> I, I decapitate the poor thing. And I'm just like, oh man, that, you know, the dream just ends at that point, you know. Oh. And I'm just like, what the f was that all about, you know? It was one weird dream. 
I only remembered it about four o'clock this afternoon, you know. That was freaky. Really, really freaky. Oh, sends shivers down my spine. I can, you know, you know, some dreams you can see how vivid the imagery is on it. So clearly. It's just like, oh no. But yeah. Ugh. But anyway. That was my last night's sleep. And I reckon it's because I'd been ill the last couple of days. And I've had like pain in my jaw and the head and everything, you know. And I was, I was probably just lying on my jaw and getting pain. And, and my mind was just hiding those memories or hiding the pain. But give me a nice fucking nightmare. So yeah, great. Thanks for that. <laughs> What if I go stronger? What if I get higher? What if I start doing things I know I will regret? I will make my own way. I will not surrender. I will do my best until I get put under. What if I go stronger?